Hello guys, hey, welcome back to the channel once again. This is Bedi News TV. As usual, as you know already, it is Bedi News TV. And today I will be talking about the transfer window that is going on. Ghanaian players are moving to clubs. You know, uh, the Amate moved from Leicester City to Bershista. And also Alexander Kwamina Juku moved from Stratbeck. Now he's playing for Fenerbahce in Turkey. And uh, also, you know, a lot of young players also want to move around. And also Baba Rahman also moved from Reading. Now he is playing for Park. Yeah, he is playing for Park. And a lot of players also want to move. Chris Mohamed moved to uh, either Brighton or West Ham United. Or any club that still hangs in the air since we So we don't know what is going to happen to Chris Mohamed. Either he will move or not. But there are a lot of players uh, with Ghana this and also moving around. Okay, we know Jeremy Duku. Okay, want to join Manchester City. And that deal is also so then we know a lot of young players also around that want to move but yeah, i'll be talking about this young and promising black star so Ringa, who has been you no know, a bid for crystal palace has bid for him eight million uh euros eight million euros so i will tell you about that but before we do that this bad news Steve, don't forget that you subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell you share this video to your friends so like and also you comment okay kindly like the video comment and share it to your friends but hey, let me also tell you about this development that is coming from ghana premier league you know ghana premier league will start on that this uh, uh 15th yeah, 15th of september and it's just around the corner we have some few days or few weeks to uh go for the ghana premier league okay so asante kotoko goalkeeper frederick asare he said that he is eyeing on winning ghana premier league okay said he want to win ghana premier league at all cost and uh, also a didi dramani assistant black stars head coach okay his assistant to black stars uh, head coach chris hilton he said that he is very happy to see Akosia Pia, a.k.a. Mayele, in Asante Kotoko Interim Management Committee. I am see. He said that uh, he's happy to see Akosia Pia in that uh, committee. Okay, so let's see how things will also go. And also, coming Sunday, yeah, coming Sunday, 20th August, 2023, uh, Midyama SC who play against Remo Stars from Nigeria in the CAF Champions League you know qualified cup champion group qualified water so they they, they, will, they, will, they will play they will play at babaya uh, that is a uh, cape coast post stadium live on this very channel coming sunday at uh, 3 p.m on this very uh channel i will give you that much very live on this now so uh coach prosper natogum he's the head coach for kumasa sante kodoko and uh, he uh you know starting parting ways with some players that i'll share with you on my social media handle it's facebook on Bedu news tv twitter uh Bed news tv and also ig Bed news tv so it's across the social media okay so everywhere anywhere you can get that and watch so some of the players are mohammed alasa as i'm going to as part ways with him and uh also samuel uh Barton, okay, so my Barton or coach, and also one man, uh, Dixon, a Fawqua, also is there. And Mohamed Alassa also has been parted with, with Asante Kotoko. Okay, so now let me tell you about this very uh, Ghanaian winger, okay, who has been bid for by Crystal Palace. Okay, so uh, the Eagles lost their key man that is uh reverse zaha okay because i know they lost the akima reverse zaha to uh gatasa right in turkey okay turkey turkey's super league and have identified fatao sahaku as a long-term replacement for fatao sahaku so in addition to uh that's um show lisi uh, who has uh, no apparently decided to join uh that's a chelsea another london rival okay so it's expected to leave the eagles creating a bigger vacuum in the setup for crystal palace so uh no rezaha has left crystal palace and also uh Olise also has decided to join chelsea so there will be a big 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 gap in crystal palace team and they would like to get another promising prayer to uh to 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 place these two guys okay um because of that uh, according to report 
in the Portuguese media, Crystal Palace have taken a step to test the waters with the offer, which is regarded as one below uh, okay the 19 years uh, no no revolution. What right? so then uh, saying that uh, that eight million euros is very small to buy Fatah Sahaku from Sporting CP. Okay, so Sporting I believe to be asking around 15 million euros for promising youngster whom they deem as talent for their future so at least so they want to at least the so crystal palace should bring 15 million uh euros okay because fata is is for the future it's not uh any player that you just take more money like an omenum for uh for them to allow him to live okay so there are reports that uh he might also move okay on loan before permanent deal is finalized as the Portuguese powerhouse uh, waiting an offer from the South London team, Crystal Palace. So they are waiting that uh, Crystal Palace will come front with another big offer so that they will uh, also uh, give them out. Okay, then given. So uh, former uh, Stephas FC forward, you no know, uh, alternate between playing for the first team in junior side. Okay. And but hey, manager Ruben Amaron, okay, so appears to be relying more on other options than the Ghanaian. The Vesta forward, who is also on the radar of Spanish outfit Red Valladolid, has represented Ghana in various national teams, including Black Stars and Black Satellite. Okay, so Fatal is a cool last season play for. The senior, uh, that is a senior team of Sporting CP, he plays more, then they will uh, send him back to the junior side, then he will play that side more, then they will bring him back. So he he been playing here and there, go here small, come here small, go here small, come here. So that's what they have been doing to him. But hey, the guy want more playing time. And uh, also not only Crystal Palace who want to sign him, but the Real Valladolid in uh, Spanish La Liga also want to sign him. So, you know, Fadal Sarko also has played for the various national teams of Ghana. So, at the under-20, uh, the Black Stars, you know, he has been playing for Black Galaxies as well. So, he's a very experienced player when he comes to playing the national team, also playing uh, professional football. So, this is uh, Fadal Sarko. He has been bid for by Crystal Palace. Let's see how this deal uh, will go. This is Bidding News TV. Don't forget that you subscribe to the channel, okay? And also, you can go to the description. I've put a link there. Go find me. I can can help me to raise funds to take care of uh, the case and uh, my foundation. They are very important case. I love them, and I know you also love them. Let's help the children to have better education. This is Bidding News TV. Let's meet another time. Bye-bye for now. Bye.